dear learners today we are going to talk about the mcqs from microbiology and the topic is bacteria we are going to cover part 3 few of the mcqs from the bacteria in our earlier video part 1 and part 2 we have seen few possible mcqs on the same topic that is bacteria so to start with part 3 first question is the question says cell wall of gram negative bacteria is whether it is thick gram negative they are asking whether it is thick whether lipids are present whether ticoic acid is absent or none of them thick it is correct lipids present is correct ticoic acid are absent and none of these the correct answer is it is ticoic acid is absent now why as you can see the structure see this is gram positive and this is gram negative in gram positive you can find lipoticoic acid ticoic acid so this is cytoplasmic membrane above that peptidoglycan is layer in gram negative there is very less peptidoglycan and lipopolysaccharide is there lipoprotein and above that there is o antigen core lipid a which is the complete structure of lipopolysaccharide whereas in gram positive ticoic acid is present so the question was with respect to gram negative the cell wall of gram negative bacteria is ticoic acids are absent next question is the bacterial cell multiplication is usually by whether it is by mitosis whether it is by meiosis whether it is by conjugation or whether it is by binary fission the correct answer is it is by binary fission the cell multiplication is usually by binary fission in the bacteria now the binary fission process is like the cell wall cytoplasmic membrane this is the cytoplasmic membrane this is the cell wall and this is the dna now after replication it divides into two the cytoplasmic membrane will elongate again this size will increase and the dna will separate now this cross wall formation takes place and the membrane invaginates the cross wall forms completely the complete lysis or complete breakdown and division into daughter cells will take place and the two cells are produced so it is binary fission fission and binary means next question is the rod shaped bacteria are known as whether they are known as cocci comma forms bacilli or pleomorphic forms the rod shaped bacteria according to the classification of bacteria based on shape the rod shaped bacteria are nothing but bacilli see here as you can see these rods are called as bacilli spheres are called as cocci and these are the spiral forms so the correct answer is rod shaped bacteria are known as bacilli next question is the question says ticoic acids are Uh, ticoic acids and ticuronic acids are found in whether it is in gram positive bacteria gram negative bacteria or fungi or none of these the correct answer is it is gram positive bacteria ticoic acid and ticuronic acid is found in gram positive bacteria ticuronic acid is located on the cell surface itself and it is covalently linked to peptidoglycan layer as you all know gram positive bacteria contains ticoic acid and ticuronic acid is also having the role in protecting the microbes and also it is responsible for interaction with the host cell next question is the question says mesosomes are a kind of ribosome formed during cell lysis a part of cell wall or principal sites of respiratory enzymes the correct answer is it is principal sites of respiratory enzyme mesosomes as we have seen the structure these are the projections of cell membrane and this gives the increased surface area for the cellular respiration so the cell, uh, respiratory enzymes are located in the mesosomes next question is the characteristic shape of the bacteria is maintained because of capsule or cell wall or cell membrane or slime layer now capsule 
when it is diffused it is known as slime layer so both the options are getting cancelled because capsules are the secretions of cell wall only and cell wall is giving the is conforming the rigidity to the bacterial structure and cell membrane is protected by the cell wall so the correct answer is it is cell wall the characteristic shape of the bacteria is maintained because of the cell wall next question is bacterial capsule is chemically composed of whether it is composed of polypeptide polynucleotide polysaccharide polypeptide or polysaccharides the correct answer is it is as you can see here chemical composition of capsule capsule composition contains polypeptide polysaccharides so the capsules as you all know capsules are also known as sometimes slime layer when they are diffused and capsules are secreted by cell wall of bacteria only and it may diffuse also so this is capsule which you can see which is secreted by the cell membrane only sorry cell wall only so the bacterial capsule is chemically composed of polypeptides or polysaccharides the correct answer is it is polypeptides or polysaccharide next question is the cell wall deficient form of bacteria is known as whether it is mycoplasma l form protoplast or spiroplast the correct answer is it is l form the cell wall the bacteria is containing having cell wall by the action of lysozymes we have seen we have discussed in uh, our part 2 video this lysozyme function these are responsible for cell wall destruction and mutation will take place and this proto protoplast will convert to the uh, different shape through the mutations which is known as l form so the bacteria the deficient uh, from cell wall uh, means they do not contain the cell wall cell wall deficient forms of bacteria are known as l forms as we have seen in the diagram when cell wall deficient forms are produced they are l forms next question from the part 3 is differences in gram positive and gram negative bacteria is shown to reside in the whether it is uh, with respect to cell wall with the nucleus cell membrane or mesosome the correct answer you all know that it is cell wall the basic difference is in cell wall why uh, gram positives will retain the primary stain and why gram negative will not retain the primary stain and they will catch the secondary stain that is safranin now as you all know this is the structure tycoic acid is present peptidoglycan is more in gram positive and it is less in gram negative whereas lipoprotein lipopolysaccharide is more in gram negative so the basic difference lies in cell wall the next question is the virulence determining antigens of the microorganism may be now virulence is nothing but virulence factors virulence is the property and virulence factors are the molecules which are produced by either bacteria viruses fungi etc protozoa etc that factors uh, means they are they are making the attachment to the cell means with the host cell these virulence factors are responsible for the attachment and they are also uh, effective uh, as in immuno invasion that is immune system of the host cell so the virulence determining antigen of the microorganism may be the options are proteins and polysaccharides carbohydrates protein complexes polysaccharide phospholipid protein complexes or all of these the correct answer is it is all of these among these any one can be the virulence determining antigen of the microorganism when this virulence factors are released see here you can see the purple color dots these are pathogenic they will enter into the host cell through various mechanisms and they will infect the cell next question is the question says bacterial locomotion is accomplished by whether it is cell wall flagella cytoskeleton or capsule so this is the very famous question you all know that the locomotory organ which is responsible is flagella now the according to the structure of flagella flagella is attached with the cell wall through this uh, through this ring system l ring p ring and uh, this forms the attachment through the hook with the bacteria 
and this flagella through the movement it is responsible for the uh, means flagella through its attachment it is responsible for the movement of the bacteria and there are various types of arrangements of flagella the flagellar arrangements like monotrichous lophotrichous amphitrichous peritrichous amphilophotrichous as you can see in the diagram single can be there a tuft that is a bunch can be there again single from one end single from uh, both the ends can be there so these are various flagellar arrangements which are the locomotory organ of the bacteria so with this we finish with few of the mcqs from part 3 of bacteria from the microbiology thank you